Welcome to Tech Tubes. You are viewing our Jetson 1 vs SkyDrive SD3 video. If you like videos about EVTOLs and other flying machines, we have more Tech Tube videos and videos from other cool channels in our playlists. Stop by our channel and check them out. Okay, the Jetson 1 vs the SkyDrive SD3. Both the Jetson 1 and SkyDrive SD3 share some common characteristics. They are multi-copter EVTOLs, which means they utilize multiple rotors for lift and maneuvering. Unlike traditional fixed-wing aircraft, EVTOLs rely on changing rotor speeds to control their flight. Essentially, they are the 21st century equivalent of passenger-carrying drones, a concept that has captured the imaginations of many. Size matters. One of the most noticeable differences between these two EVTOLs is their size. The Jetson 1, designed with recreational use in mind, boasts a compact and lightweight design. Its modest footprint and low weight make it incredibly maneuverable, a perfect fit for those who seek thrilling personal flight experiences. It comfortably falls within the ultralight category. On the other hand, the SkyDrive SD3 is a giant in comparison, measuring an impressive 4 x 4 x 2 meters and tipping the scales at 400 kilograms when empty. With a pilot on board, it can carry up to 500 kilograms, exceeding the constraints of the ultralight category. The stark contrast in size between the two EVTOLs directly influences their performance characteristics, as we shall explore in more detail. The clock is ticking. Now, let's talk about one of the most critical aspects of EVTOL technology, flight time. The Jetson 1, with its nimble design, offers an exhilarating 20 minutes of flight time when carrying an 85-kilogram occupant. However, this flight time dwindles to a mere 5 minutes when the payload is increased to 100 kilograms. To operate the Jetson 1, you can enroll in Jetson's 2-day training program, and there's no need for a pilot's license. For those with a passion for personal aviation, the Jetson 1 comes with a price tag of $92,000. Keep in mind that weight plays a pivotal role in the flight time equation, as even a 10% increase in weight necessitates a 15% increase in power, underscoring the delicate balance between performance and payload. Safety is a paramount concern, and the Jetson 1 addresses this with an aluminum and composite chassis featuring crumpled zones to enhance passenger safety. In the event of an unexpected landing, these safety measures provide peace of mind to those who seek adventure in the skies. The Jetson 1's top speed is an impressive 101 km per hour, and it can ascend to a maximum altitude of 457 meters. Its power source consists of swappable 52-volt lithium-ion modules, a testament to the adaptability and ease of maintenance of this EVTOL. Setting sky-high expectations Turning our attention to the SkyDrive SD3, we find ourselves in the presence of a colossal EVTOL. Its dimensions, measuring 4x4x2 four by four by meters, exude an aura of authority and capability. When empty, it weighs a robust 400 kilograms, and with the pilot on board, it can reach a total weight of 500 kilograms, catapulting it beyond the boundaries of the ultralight category. Despite its larger battery pack and formidable propellers, the SkyDrive SD3 presents us with a shorter flight time of 5 to 10 minutes, depending on the payload. This intriguing paradox emphasizes a crucial principle in EVTOL design, the weight-power relationship. Adding more batteries, while seemingly a straightforward solution to increase flight time, often leads to diminishing returns. The extra weight necessitates more power, which in turn reduces overall efficiency. However, the quest for extended flight time doesn't end here. Innovative solutions are on the horizon, such as capturing rebounding air from the ground, a phenomenon known as fountain lift. By harnessing this force and incorporating higher energy density batteries, EVTOLs like the Jetson 1 may soon achieve flight times that rival conventional aircraft. Future batteries with a remarkable 500 watts per kilogram energy density could potentially extend the Jetson 1's flight time to an astounding 34 minutes, marking a significant leap forward in personal aerial transportation. Exploring the flight time puzzle. As we dive deeper into the world of EVTOLs, it becomes evident that flight time is a complex puzzle with multiple pieces. Increasing battery size, rotor size, and energy density are all potential solutions to the riddle of extending flight time. However, striking the right balance between flight time, cost, and weight remains a formidable challenge for engineers and designers alike. In the case of the Jetson 1 and the SkyDrive SD3, their unique characteristics shine through, underscoring the diversity of EVTOL technology. 
Let's revisit the key differences between these two remarkable aircraft. Size and weight. The Jetson 1, with its compact and lightweight design, is tailored for recreational use. Its smaller footprint and lower weight make it an agile and accessible choice for those seeking a taste of personal flight. The Jetson 1 comfortably fits within the ultralight category, making it a convenient and thrilling option for enthusiasts. In stark contrast, the SkyDrive SD3 emerges as a Titan, boasting nearly twice the size of the Jetson 1. Its substantial physical presence and higher weight position it outside the confines of the ultralight category, signaling its readiness for more significant roles in urban air mobility and transportation. Flight Time The Jetson 1 offers an impressive flight time of approximately 20 minutes when carrying an 85kg occupant. However, this flight time experiences a significant reduction to just 5 minutes when the payload is increased to 100 kilograms. This versatility allows for thrilling personal flights but also highlights the importance of managing weight for extended airtime. On the other hand, the SkyDrive SD3, despite its larger size and battery capacity, delivers a relatively short flight time of 5 to 10 minutes, depending on the payload. This concise flight duration aligns with the SkyDrive SD3's core mission as a transportation aid. While it may not offer extended recreational flights, it's poised to provide efficient urban air mobility solutions for daily commuters and city dwellers. Purpose and Use The Jetson One's primary purpose is to provide a thrilling and immersive recreational flying experience. It caters to individuals who harbor a deep-seated desire to take to the skies and explore the world from a different perspective. Designed with simplicity and agility in mind, it's the ideal companion for those seeking a taste of personal flight. In stark contrast, the SkyDrive SD3's mission extends far beyond recreation. It envisions a future where urban air mobility becomes an integral part of daily life. Imagine soaring above congested city streets, bypassing traffic jams, and reaching your destination swiftly and efficiently. The SkyDrive SD3's larger size and payload capacity position it as a potential solution for easing daily commutes, revolutionizing urban transportation as we know it. Join us for more insights. Before we proceed with further insights into these remarkable EVTOLs, we kindly invite you to subscribe to our channel. Your support electrifies our mission to bring you the latest in tech innovations, and by subscribing, you become part of our passionate community of tech enthusiasts. When it comes to speed, the Jetson 1 takes the lead with an impressive top speed of 101 km per hour or 63 miles per hour. This exhilarating velocity ensures an exciting and fast-paced flying experience, further enhancing its appeal for thrill-seekers. Conversely, the SkyDrive SD3 opts for a more moderate top speed of 50 km per hour or 31 miles per hour. While it may not match the Jetson 1 in terms of sheer speed, this deliberate choice aligns with the SD3's urban transportation focus. The emphasis here is on safe and controlled movement within urban environments, where rapid acceleration and deceleration are crucial. Altitude Elevation plays a significant role in the capabilities of EVTOLs. The Jetson 1 can ascend to a maximum altitude of 457 meters or 1,500 feet, granting passengers breathtaking panoramic views from well above the ground. This ability to reach considerable heights adds a new dimension to the recreational flying experience, as riders can explore the world from a vantage point reserved for the few. In contrast, the SkyDrive SD3 is designed for a different altitude range. It can comfortably reach an altitude of 150 meters, aligning with its urban air mobility mission. This height provides ample clearance for navigating the intricacies of cityscapes while adhering to safety regulations and airspace management. Design and safety features Safety is paramount in the world of aviation, and both the Jetson 1 and the SkyDrive SD3 address this concern with unique design features. The Jetson 1 boasts an aluminum and composite chassis equipped with crumple zones, serving as a protective cocoon for passengers in case of an unexpected landing or collision. This focus on safety ensures that those who embark on recreational flights can do so with confidence and peace of mind. The Jetson 1's design philosophy centers around agility and simplicity, offering an accessible and thrilling experience for all. In contrast, the SkyDrive SD3 takes a different approach to design. It incorporates landing skids and a cockpit that encloses the pilot, emphasizing a design orientation toward urban air mobility and transportation. 
While the Jetson 1 prioritizes recreational agility, the SkyDrive SD3's design caters to the safety and comfort of commuters and passengers in urban environments. It's a testament to the diverse applications of EVTOL technology. Market and Pricing Finally, let's explore the market positioning and pricing of these two remarkable EVTOLs. The Jetson 1 is currently available to recreation enthusiasts, priced at $92,000. This approach positions it as an accessible option for those who wish to indulge in personal flying experiences. It's an investment in adventure, freedom, and a chance to explore the skies on your terms. On the other hand, the SkyDrive SD3 is still in an intermediate development phase, with plans to take flight in 2025. Its target market extends beyond recreational enthusiasts, envisioning a broader audience seeking efficient urban transportation solutions. While specific pricing and service models are yet to be finalized, the SD3's mission to transform urban mobility indicates a commitment to accessibility and scalability in the urban air transportation market. In summary, the Jetson 1 and the SkyDrive SD3, while both EVTOLs, showcase the incredible diversity and potential within the realm of personal electric aerial vehicles. Their differences in size, flight time, intended use, top speeds, altitudes, design features, and target markets paint a vivid picture of the burgeoning EVTOL landscape. As we navigate the skies of innovation and technology, we must remember that the future of personal aviation is electric, efficient, and adaptable. The Jetson 1 invites us to explore the thrills of personal flight, while the SkyDrive SD3 carries the promise of transforming our daily commutes and urban mobility experiences. In the quest for extended flight time, innovative solutions continue to emerge, offering hope for even more remarkable aerial adventures in the years to come. With each technological leap, we inch closer to a future where the skies are no longer a limit but a realm of endless possibilities. We hope you've enjoyed this exploration of the Jetson 1 and the SkyDrive SD3. If you found this video enjoyable or informative, please subscribe to our channel and join us on our journey through the frontiers of technology. Thank you for visiting TechTubes.